Hello everyone. So in this video again, we have come up with a very unique question pertaining to matrices. So let's go through the question. Consider the following 3 by 2 matrix or 3 by 2 array formed by using numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. So we have been, give, uh, we have been given a matrix over here. So this is the matrix in question here. Basically A11, A212, A21, A22, A31, A33 and this is the corresponding but it will say 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Observe that all uh, rows are equal, but the sum of the squares is not the same for each row. Okay, as you can see, uh, 6 plus 1 basically gives us 7, 5 plus 2 basically gives us 7, 3 plus 4 basically gives us 7. So basically, sums of squares are not same for each. Extend the above area into 3 into k form, or uh, where this is the uh, form for a suitable k. Adding more columns using numbers 7, 8, 9 and I think up to 3k such that summation j equal to 1 a1j, uh, summation k uh, j equal to 1 a2j, summation k from a j equal to 1 a3j and summation j equal to 1 k a1j squared equal to summation uh, j equal to 1 k. So basically we have to prove uh, to basically the extend the same matrix in this particular form. So let's uh, go about solving this particular question and let's take a look how, to, how we can approach this particular question in general. Let's start off. So what we have here, suppose, suppose we have a term like 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus dot dot dot. Okay. And we extend this till 3k. So uh, the following we can write in this particular form equal to 3k. k into 3k plus 1 by 2. Okay, basically sum of all this we can write it in this form and also we can again further uh, write sigma k j equal to 1 a 1j so it will be something like k into uh, 3k plus 1 by 2. So this particular term will be an integer. Alright. So now let's go about. So also one square plus two square plus three square plus dot 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 three k square can be written as three k into three k plus one into 6k plus 1 by 2. Basically, we have used the sum of squares formula here. Okay, so let's, uh, and as, again, if we continue forward with this, as sigma k, j equal to 1, sorry, 1j squared, if we go ahead with this, then summation of the same would be something on the likes of okay, plus 1 6k plus 1 by 2 so this would again give us okay, okay so this is what we have here now Let's claim, say, let's claim if K and K greater than three, then it is. Is possible when it is possible. So, if you are looking for the proof of the same, then let's uh, take a look at the following. Suppose we have the terms like n square plus 
n plus 5 whole square minus n plus 1 whole square plus n plus 4 whole square equal to 8. Subsequently, subsequently we have m plus n or uh, m plus 1 whole square plus m plus 4 whole square minus m plus 2 3 whole square equal to 4 and subsequently we have something like L square plus L plus 5 whole square minus L plus 2 whole square plus L plus 3 whole square equal to 12 okay now we are uh, here we have 8 plus 4 equal to 12 okay so this can also basically be implied that, that n square plus n plus 5 whole square minus okay plus let me add all these terms up m plus 1 whole square plus m plus 4 whole square plus l plus 2 whole square plus l plus 3 whole square would be equal to n plus 1 whole square plus n plus 4 whole square plus m plus 2 whole square plus m plus 3 whole square plus l square plus L plus 5 whole square. So what we did here is nothing but suppose I take this is equation 1, this is equation 2 and this is equation 3. So what we did here is 1 plus 2 equal to 3 and we have basically sorted both the terms out. So basically we have taken the negative on one side and positive on the other side. Okay. So with that said now we will go on also n plus n plus 5 plus m plus 1 plus m plus 4 plus l plus 2 plus l plus 3 would basically give us twice n plus twice m plus twice l plus 15. So this can be further written as n plus 1 plus n plus 4 plus m plus 2 m plus 3 square plus l square plus l plus 5 whole square. Sorry my bad, this is a small calculation error. Just give me a second.
uh, my bad guys. So uh, what we'll be able to write here is basically n plus 1 plus n plus 4 plus m plus 2 plus m plus 3 plus l plus l plus 5. So hence 1 square plus 6 square plus 8 square plus 11 square plus 15 square plus 16 square subsequently 2 square plus 5 square plus 9 square plus 10 square plus 13 square plus 18 square and finally 3 square plus 4 square plus 7 square plus 12 square plus 14 square plus 17 square so this could be further written in this form 1 6 8 11 15 16 subsequently 2 5 9 10 13 18 followed by 3 4 7 12 14 and 17 so this will be our required matrix so this particular thing this particular matrix it is satisfying satisfying the desired condition similarly if I am to talk about the same so similarly we can find similarly we can find 1 6 8 11 18 13 21 23 25 5 7 12 15 17 19 22 27 followed by 3 4 9 10 14 16 20 24 and 26 which satisfies all conditions we can also do the following observation from here which are so the observations will be something like n plus oh, just give me a second let me just we also observe we also observe n plus 1 whole square plus n plus 6 whole square plus n plus 8 whole square plus n plus 11 whole square n plus 15 square plus n plus 16 whole square square so which can be further written as n plus 2 whole square plus n plus 5 whole square plus n plus 9 whole square plus n plus 10 whole square plus n plus 13 whole square plus n plus 18 whole square and subsequently n plus 3 square plus n plus 4 whole square 
plus n plus 7 whole square plus n plus 12 whole square plus n plus 14 square and finally n plus 17 whole square here we can can always here we can always get a construction for k plus 6 from a construction of k as we already as we already got k equal to 6 and k equal to 9 by induction It is true for all k such that k common k is greater than three. So for k equal to three, we can directly check that it will not happen so with that the problem basically comes to an end so i suggest you go through the problem in whole and try to solve it uh, just by you following the steps you say so they can get a better understanding on the same so with that said we have come to the end of the video signing out thank you so much